I mean, this fragrance title is so narcissistic that you would think it's my brand. Oh my God! <laughs> I'm gorgeous! I bought this joint off of Amazon and it was only $15, but I mean, there's a reason why I bought it. It's Cuba right here, Cuba the original, and authentic Cuba. How many times are you gonna put Cuba on a packaging? You would think this joint is mine, but the presentation itself looks like a very close inspiration to a niche brand. And for $15, I wanna see if this is the new interpretation of those old school Cuba cigar fragrances in 2024. Ah, of course there's Cuba right up here too. Let's roll my music so we can check out the authentic Cuba with the Cuba, with the Cuba seal and the Cuba on top, to see if it's really Cuban. Plus, you my beautiful peoples, you know who it is. It's your boy, C to the U to the B to the A. $15 and like 98 cents from Amazon. And let's see, if you're a fragrance connoisseur, if you're an enthusiast, a collector in the fragrance space, without Googling it, see if you can tell what this bottle looks like. I know it's crazy to think, but if I shake this, see if you can picture what this bottle looks like. And I wanna see how many of y'all can honestly say that you got it right, listen. That's kind of difficult to tell, but if you know what the bottle looks like, you'll be like, oh yeah, it sounds like this. And while opening this presentation, this Cuba Authentic Dark Scent Profile looks like, yeah, one of those Montau fragrances. This is probably inspired by Montau. I would love that if this is like an Aventus clone and it has a Montau presentation. I mean, one to one. Can you tell the difference? Disrespect, although it's got a Cuba tag on there, so I'll go for this one more. So authentic Cuba dark is supposed to be budget, I'm assuming interpretation of some sort of Montau fragrance. It's the exact same, I mean, this is when they ask, yo, why do we go to clones? I mean, cause packaging's mad expensive. Nobody would ever replicate that. Yeah. So this seems to be the new rendition of those old school decans that look like glass cigars. I had a ton of them. They replicated JPG fragrances, Paco Rabanne fragrances, a great, great stocking stuffer many moons ago that I thought was super swaggy. I loved how they looked, but those decans were mad fragile. Not gonna front. When the glass ones were still around, if you nicked that thing the wrong way, it was a wrap. I have no idea who, what, where this is trying to clone, but uh, we shall see and I'm assuming it's gonna be some sort of Montau fragrance. Okay, I do recognize this, but what is it? Fresh, green, hmm. Kind of smells old school classic. I know this scent 100%. I don't think this is Montau though. What the hell is this? It's a little faint on paper. Classic, green, slightly spicy. I'm trying to think what this particular fragrance is. Let me try this on skin. It's green, classic, spicy, peppery, old school kind of vibes. Very faint, it's a little light. It's a good scent. It's a very good scent. Let me see if I can look up notes. So the notes are listed as pear, pink pepper, bergamot, lemon, spicy notes, cedar. I don't know of any Montau fragrance that smells like this. It's fucking weak though. It's real weak. Shit's weak. It's good, but it's weak. The citrus is coming off a little bright. I'm not really getting pear. I was joking. <laughs> you have no power here. When I first said, I don't know what this is cloning. Imagine if this is gonna be a Creed Aventus clone of some sort. It's not a Creed Aventus clone. It's definitely not a Montau clone, but it is a Creed clone. Creed Royal Oud is the clone that it's trying to replicate and not doing it very successfully. This smells like a $15 fragrance. It's nice, it's green, it's herbal, it's peppery, it's very weak, very faint. Why would you put a Montau? That was a joke. Why would you use a Montau fragrance look to put a Creed? That's like really just like putting it over the fucking top at this point. But it's a shitty interpretation of Creed's royal mood. Not good at all. This is like if you were trying to make this more juvenile and wearable to like teens who are on a budget, failed miserably. I don't like crying in front of you guys because I don't want you to think that I'm weak. Like no wonder you couldn't pinpoint this shit. Doesn't really smell like it. It's a pretty sad interpretation, pretty pathetic actually. They did a fantastical job just taking the presentation, but using it to make a Creed fragrance is 
wild. This is legendary. This is fantastic. This is swaggy. Creed Royal Oud is one of the best, in my opinion, from that Creed lineup. This is not a good interpretation of this. It does smell 100% like a $15 fragrance. I would put this shit more like a $6 fragrance, to be honest with you. Bring back the old cigars, because at least those had some balls. Absolutely not a ball spray. Don't spend your money on this joint, because it's absolute junk. I love y'all mother suckers from the heart. Quick, direct, to the point. It's trying to be a clone of this and failed miserably. I'll see y'all snitches next time. You know who it is, biggest in the game. Disappointing the Cuban people. Smooches. Hey, for all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse, we don't talk on my mom's crib. As long as you never get in, as long as you would think that you would.